Hey YouTube, welcome back to another video. In today's video, should be short, uh, quick and fun one. We're putting the vinyl wrap on the Toyota Grill emblem. It's been sitting on my shelf for weeks now. Finally have time to do it. Uh, I really don't have a plan of attack to do it. I'm just gonna figure it out step by step and uh, you'll be seeing how it turns out. Here we go. Do a simple wash and dry. I figured it'd be much easier if it was still on the truck. All right, you're gonna take off all these Phillips screw heads. There's two silver ones here. And there's two that are Phillips and uh, I think 10 mil. And then get the sensor off. Let's try that first. All right, here's what it looks like. The sensor is dangling down there. So yeah, just the four screws I was uh, talking about earlier, the uh, two 10 millimeter ones or Phillips and then the two silver ones. So we're left with, left with this and we're just gonna pry on the tabs at uh, all four corners and then hopefully this thing just pops out. Well, as you can see here, I broke off a tab. But well, we move forward. I really don't have any tips, but just really take your time. I thought I was taking my time. I wasn't sure if I was pressing hard enough because it was one of the first time the thing's been out. So it's, it's you know, it's not loose. Uh, you know, when, uh, after you've taken out a piece of plastic, you know, multiple times, it becomes loose. So, but anyways, this was, still stuck in there pretty good so yeah really just take your time if it breaks it breaks it's really the back piece of paper that's all rolled up once you get the vinyl off once you get the vinyl off, it's no problem. Good, I'm just eyeing this. Make sure you have the cover right side up, because that matters. In this stage, the focus is to get the vinyl as centered as possible. I really don't have any tips for this other than to keep checking your work and shifting the vinyl as needed. The struggle is real. Once you are here, pull the vinyl out and down to get a smooth edge. Once you are satisfied with the edging, grab a sharp tool and start cutting off the excess vinyl. So don't cut right along the edge, but save enough of the vinyl so that it'll still have enough bite onto the back side of this cover. So this video concludes the front end vinyl uh, install. 
a two-part series, I guess. One for the fairing and one for the grill um, emblem. I'm pretty happy with the way it turned out. It's not perfect, but um, I think other people see it. I think it'll look fine. But to me, it's not perfect because I, the one, I was the one that installed it. But anyways, um, pretty happy with it, pretty stoked with it. I'm happy with the way it turned out. I didn't need a heat gun. Uh, ran into some bumps here and there, broke off uh, a tab. You know, um, oh yeah, I was gonna mention one thing. There is one screw, the bottom silver screw that holds the uh, the cover, the, the cover I just wrapped onto the grill. So as long as you have that one screw, you're good. Um, if you broke all four, if you still had that one screw, I think you're still gonna be fine, really. So, so if you broke a tab, don't even worry about it. It'll turn out fine. It'll still hold up fine. Anyways, hope you enjoy this quick, short, fun video, and um, we'll see you next time. Peace.